Hey there friends, how's it going? Thanks for tuning in today. I'm recording this video with my Google Pixel phone without any external microphones. Let's see how it does. I'm doing a little bit of a review on it and also a very special announcement on the end of this video. So stay tuned. Would owning a Google Pixel phone make me a smarter or better person? Would wearing a Jamaican shirt make the Canadian winter feel warmer? Good questions. Hello, my name is Pedro and you're watching your world's world. Thanks for tuning in. I would like to do a short review on the Google Pixel. Let's start off with the basic specs of the phone. The Google Pixel and the Google Pixel XL were released in October 2016. There are not too many differences between the Google Pixel and the Google Pixel XL. The Pixel XL has a screen of 5.5 inches, where the Google Pixel has a 5 inch screen. The other part is the batteries. The Pixel XL has a non-removable 3450 mAh battery, and the Pixel has a 2770 mAh battery. They both have a very fast charging battery. Personally, I believe I experienced up to 20 to 40 minutes charging time, although sometimes it can take up to an hour. They both run Android 7.1 Nugget. They both have a processor of a 2.15 quad-core Qualcomm Snapdragon 821. They both have 4 gigabytes of RAM and it's available in 32 and 128 gigabytes. It has the fingerprint scanner in the back, which also can be used to swipe down your notifications bar. Special features are Google Assistant built-in and unlimited cloud storage. That's pretty awesome. The primary camera is 12.3 megapixels, aperture f-stop 2.0, phase detection and laser autofocus, dual LED, dual tone flash. The video quality is fantastic. It shoots at 1080p at 30 frames per second and 60 frames per second, as well as 120 frames per second, which is obviously slow motion. And at 720p, it can shoot 30, 60, and 240 frames per second. And it obviously has 4K, which only shoots at 30 frames per second, which is pretty awesome. The secondary front-facing camera has eight megapixels. Aperture stop at 2.4. That one shoots at 1080p. You can get the Google Pixel in quite black, very silver, and really blue. But I have not seen the really blue in Canada or at any Canadian dealers, only in the US so far. The Google Pixel 32GB retails at Amazon.ca at about $850 Canadian dollars. The Pixel XL 32GB at around $1,100, which is pretty pricey, but they're both unlocked. And on Amazon.com, which is USA, the Google Pixel 32 gigabyte unlocked retails at about 775 US dollars. And the Pixel XL, about 950 US dollars. I will leave some links down below to Google phone and Amazon down in the description of this video. If you're interested, go ahead and check it out. The Bluetooth of this phone is fantastic. The quality of the audio that is passing through it, it is very good. It's a very high quality compared to what I heard in the past. It transmits at the frequency of 4.2. The only thing that I found that on some devices that it connects to, it wants to disconnect every once in a while. Not sure what the issue is there, but I'm sure Google will be working on it to figure that out, that they can fix it bug with an update. So all in all, my thoughts on the phone, I really like it. I did get the Google Pixel, not the XL. The reason being they didn't have the XL at the wireless store, but now that I have this one, I really like it. It handles very nicely. A few downsides that I found on this phone is that it slips very easy. It can fall and can get damaged away. I found a couple of very good cases that I really like. It does not make the phone feel much thicker. The cases, they fit very nice around the phone. And the other down part I find is it is not waterproof, but who goes swimming with a smartphone anyways? Now, all in all, do I like the Google Pixel? Uh, would I recommend it to you guys? Absolutely. It's a very good device. Google really came out by doing this. And if you like the Android system the way I do, then you'll definitely want to check into one of these. A couple more things that I'd like to mention I really like about the Google Pixel. First off being it has very, very good cell reception. I had a Samsung Galaxy S5 till now. Compared to that one, the cell phone service is way better. And the other thing is the camera. When I buy a phone, one of my main reasons is the camera, the quality, how it operates. I am very fascinated by this camera. It has a very high resolution, a very high quality. Great, I'm very impressed with it. Let me show you what I mean.
And the video quality, very, very good. I'll show you a little bit of footage from videos that I shot with this camera. Today's quote of the day is don't be afraid of taking risks. Feel free to stand in front of a snake warning sign, but don't step on the snake. Now, the moment that we've been waiting for, as I said in the beginning of this video, I will have a very special announcement in this video. Are you ready? When I first opened this YouTube channel, I mentioned that I would do a giveaway to the subscribers to my channel. It took a while, we were on vacation for a month, so I apologize for it that it took so long, but the moment of truth, here are the names. Let's pick a winner. I'm not looking. Who will it be? Who will it be? I close my eyes. Here. Upside down. Upside down. Mm. Here's the winner. Congratulations. Who is it? Dickie Wolf. Congratulations. You are the winner of the giveaway. So you'll be contacted. Thank you guys for being part of this channel. I really appreciate it. It's a very good community and I hope to grow it to a channel and that you guys can enjoy the videos that I make. Thanks for being part of it. And I hope you stick around for a long time. This has been another video friends. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you haven't yet, please hit the subscribe button and the bell notifications button that you get notified when new videos get released. I have some videos coming that I'm very excited about. Thank you very much for watching. Stay cool, be awesome, and do good. Hasta la vista, friends. Until next time, I gotta go to work.